writing sporty on my back doesn't make me feel sporty. This, this, you know, Catwoman aesthetic, Spider Woman, well, kind of. Well, hello friends, welcome to, to my bedroom. That feels kind of weird to say out loud. Welcome to the video, let's say that. It's been a while since I've done like a try on, but I did some shopping from Bow & Tea, as you can see, and from the title of this video, I'm gonna do a try on. I was just about to try the clothes on, then I was like, oh, I'm back on the YouTube game. Let me just film the stuff and show them because I love fitness wear. I am stepping into a new era of my fitness journey, just really loving my body, looking after it. And I love to look good, or at least to feel like I look good when I do so. I've shopped from Bow & Tea so many times before. I've never been sponsored by them. This isn't sponsored, um, but I tend to just love their clothes. They make me feel great. I... I don't know if I look after them as well as I should, but I do make good use of them. So the other day I was like, right, if we're gonna do this, let's do this, let's enjoy it. Let's get ourselves a treat at the start of the fitness journey, which is dubious, but it's done now, it's done. Here's the stuff, I may as well try it on and show you guys. I bought a wide range, but also with the viewpoint of the stuff that I'm gonna be filming for you guys and the kind of different looks that I would love to serve while I serve. I don't just buy a load of stuff for buying sake. I'm actually trying to declutter and I gave away a load of old fitness clothes the other day that I'd had for years but just weren't filling me with joy. And so I've made room for some new babies to come into my closet. I think the last time I bought a load of clothes was in January when I was starting my play, the play I was in at the National Theatre and I just didn't have enough comfortable rehearsal clothes so I did a Tala shop and a Primark shop which is just a gorgeous combination. And it works really well. Um, but these will be for like filming and looking cute while I work out. So without further ado, let's try on the first outfit. Alrighty friends, um, here is the first outfit. Um, it's giving fresh prints. It's giving fresh prints Will Smith, which I love. I loved Will Smith in The Fresh Prince. This is not really me. Like, I go through phases. Sometimes I'm like, colour is life. Why would I Why would I want to wear anything but bright colours? But recently, I've had a quite a long phase, like a two-year phase <laughs> of, like, just not loving colour as much as I used to, maybe? I don't know, maybe not. But usually, like, recently for athletics clothes or, like, training clothes, I've gone for, like, blacks and neutrals and like earthy colors but recently I was like yeah let's bring some color back and to the channel as well I just feel like a pop of color is really motivating and exciting so I thought I would try these now my first impressions are that it is cute it does look like what it looked like on the website um I already knew that some of it wasn't very me like this the fact that it says sporty on the back feels feels like a joke. I feel like I'm a 15 year old athlete again who is getting annoyed at people not taking my profession seriously, which is women in sports. So seeing someone write sporty on the back of a jacket kind of annoys me. <laughs> I don't know why, it feels, like, it feels like I'm making fun of myself, like, oh, I'm sporty. Like, no, yes, I am. I'm a serious athlete, take me seriously. Um, so I don't know, that, that's not quite me, but I do love the fit of this jacket. Now they've given like, ugh, one of these, return safe handle so I can't really get into it as comfortably as I would but I got this in a small medium and it is definitely big enough I love an oversized jacket this feels like something that you can throw on you can fold away put it in your bag and it's not too stressed too much stress to carry you know like on a summer day when it's really hot and you don't want a jacket but you might want like a light non-sweaty jacket later this feels like that this really does it feels very cute Part of me wishes that my boyfriend would buy something like this for real, wear it long enough that it's actually his so that I can steal it, you know? But whether I wanna buy it for myself, I don't know. And then we've got the crop top. The crop top is cute, it's cute. It's not, it's not for sprinting, I don't think. I don't think it's the most supportive thing. I will not be giving a demonstration, but I can feel that it's not the most supportive thing, but it is cute. It does look good. Um, the shorts. <laughs> now, I knew this when I ordered the shorts. I knew that for me, when I'm wearing running shorts, I like an under layer so that you've got like the knickers, so if they blow up, you're not showing anything. These do not have an underlayer. They don't have an underlayer, which was predictable. 
And I knew that by the pictures on the website. Um, but it just means that you do need to wear like granny panties with it. If you're going to be like lying on the floor doing hip thrusts, if you don't want people seeing everything, then yeah, definitely wear some shorts underneath it. But overall, like running wise, they feel really good. I love them. The only thing is I got this in a small, which honestly I thought was ambitious. And I definitely 100% gained weight and I don't think I didn't think I was a small I thought I'd be a medium and um, but if I get this jacket off the, these shorts I mean if I relax if I relax they stay up but I'm not really going to be running like that when I'm exercising I do like my core is embraced so they are giving more room than I thought they would give and part of me is like do I want an extra small I haven't bought an extra small I, I'm not sure ever maybe back in the day but no, I don't really do extra small. So the waist, it's elasticated, which is great. I love that. But it is bigger than I thought it would be. And I don't I don't think I have a particularly small waist relative to the rest of my body. Um, I think I know that I have big thighs, but small waist, meh. Um, so yeah, bear that in mind. I probably would size down in the shorts if I was ordering again. But overall, I feel like, I feel like this is cute. I feel like I like it. I do like it. And part of me likes the extra space. I don't know. It's giving summer abs, you know? Okay. I think I might keep this. I don't know whether to size down in the shorts. I guess I could, it means I could wear them lower, but that is just, it's not really for me. It's just not really for me. I'm a high waist girl. I know, I'm sorry. I was born in the 90s. I just, I just want, I just want my waist covered. <laughs> oh, I do love it though. I do love it. Can I squat? I can squat. Can I run? I can run. I love it. I love it. This is cute. I think I love it. I think I might keep these guys. This is the second outfit. It is, I don't know what it's called. I'll put the name in somewhere. But um, I got this because of the pop of colour. I'm not going to lie to you. I was like, that'll look really cute in my videos. Let's buy it. Having received it, the material is giving unserious. It's giving unserious. It's giving, I would like someone to want to touch me, like, because it's so soft. Does that make sense? I don't know if that makes sense, but it's almost, it's almost, it feels like the least sweat appropriate material that I have experienced in gym clothes. I probably didn't read the description of what it was before I bought it. Aside from that, which is quite a big aside, I don't know how I feel about the, the, the material. It's just too, it's giving cozies. I would rather that these were loose, loose cozies than tight gym wear. I don't know. But aside from that, they are cute. I love a little V on the shorts. This, people who put tags in annoying places for trying clothes on, Oh, but really, 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 anyway. I do love the cut though. The fit of this I think is super, super cute. So I'm tempted to just keep it as like a cover photos outfit, <laughs> like a YouTube video cover outfit. I do like it. I feel like I can move. <laughs> I can move in it. Do you know what I should do? I should do the water test. When you put water on it and just see how sweat would show up, I have a feeling this one is gonna be a very bad water test. Let's try it, shall we? Okay, got some water. Oh yeah, that's bad. That's it. That is gonna look like I peed myself, 100%. Right, so let me show you. This is the water test result. I mean, it's not too bad, but yeah, a bit of sweat is definitely gonna look like you peed yourself. Cute though, I think I might keep. I, th I think it's flattering. I think the fit, the neckline and the shorts, they are flattering and I do love that. I appreciate you, Bowen T. You do do good fits. Okay, on to the next. Okay guys, so this is the third set to try on. So it's essentially the same as the orange one, but in pink. Now, the pink is definitely more of a bubblegum pink than a baby pink, if that makes sense. It's a lot brighter and like, it's doing a lot. It's doing a lot more than I thought it would. Should I just move this up a bit? So it's doing a lot more than I thought it would, color-wise. But again, I do actually like the fit. I just find it quite flattering. Um, I love this V kind of point. I think it really makes the abs pop a little. Um, yeah, it is the same thing of the material being like super soft, which is not the best for working out, but my priorities are a little different with these sets. They were always for a visual. I don't think, 
I don't plan on wearing this to the gym. Maybe the top or the shorts separately, but both together as a set. It's not really my vibe for when I'm like full on in a workout. There's the back design of it. Um, yeah, pretty plain on the back. But what I do like is that I'm not like a massive branding person. Like I'm not a huge designer label girl. Obviously these are both, they're not designer. <laughs> um, but what I do like is the sets which the brand, the label is the same color as the material. I don't like it when it's a massive Bowen tea text. Like I don't need to be, I'm not a walking advert. Do you know what I mean? I'm not a walking advert, pay me for it. So yeah, I like the fact that the branding is very small as you can see on the top and down there. Okay, so this is set number three. Let me know what you think in the comments. Keep or chuck back. I will say this material and this fit is not the most flattering for the lower belly in terms of it shows every single curve, but like I have a belly. That's okay. <laughs> like that's not it's not something I'm massively worried about. Like, oh my gosh, my love handles or whatever. Like, okay. Fat there is just as good as fat there. Thank you very much. Okay, next outfit. Yes, this is a bit of me. This is a bit of me. I had wanted this set so long ago, you guys, like a year ago, I think they released it, but it was all sold out. So I didn't, I got some Tala stuff instead, but I could just tell by the fit of this, the lining of it, I knew I would love it. This is giving ninja. Now this makes me feel, right and sporty on my back doesn't make me feel sporty. This, this, you know, Catwoman, aesthetic spider woman well kind of but this is giving i love it i'm a bit gutted that it doesn't have like the thumb holes because i like the way they elongate the arms and you have the option of using them or not using them but the fit of this jacket it feels so soft it is so so soft it is a little sweaty soft it's i think this is more of a winter outfit but whatever <laughs> there's one thing about living in the uk winter is always coming so you're good it's giving you know a little bit of winter but I did also get these with the black trousers, so the flare leggings, which I've also wanted for ages. I ended up just getting some random like H&M cheapy ones. But these are so much better. The way they are fitting, the fact that they've got the pocket for the phone. I don't know where my phone is right now, but um, the fact they've got the pocket for the phone. I didn't get them in, I didn't get them in petite. So I'm five foot three and a half. These, this is the regular length, which looks a bit awkward right now. I think it'll be fine with trainers. I think with trainers, it'll give what I want it to give. Can you see? Like that's me flat footed, five foot three. Yeah, I think it's good. Love the V again. I always think that's flattering, but love the height of them as well. They're not like too high waist. Oh, you can hoik them up a bit more, but they're not too high waist, but they, for me, they cut at a flattering place, which especially as a shorter girly, I don't even think I'm short, you guys. People keep telling me I'm short. And so I've started to take that on as an identity. I'm not short, but for someone my height, <laughs> for someone my height, um, like I think it cuts in a good place, which you always have to be aware of because sometimes things are made for like taller, taller bodies. So yeah, these leggings, oh, I love these. I love these, love these, love these. I might even film some stuff in this. This is more, these are more what I would wear to the gym personally. I think I'd feel more comfortable in that outfit going to the gym than the bright mini two pieces. They're more for like me, my own enjoyment. These are more for like practical exercising, commute to the gym. Approval given. Now let me try on the next trousers. Guys, I actually gasped when I put these on. I actually gasped, I went, oh, because they're just so soft. They're so comfy. I want these. Well, I guess I, I have these, but I want them. You know when you just need a pair of trousers to throw on, but you don't want to look too saggy and baggy? I think these are them. And there's pockets. Ugh, yeah, I really like these. I can't remember how much they were. I'll have to double check. And they don't have, that's a bit annoying. There's nothing to tighten them with, but the fit is much better than the shorts. That's, that's the snap back elasticated waist I want. Okay, it doesn't need to be baggy to snap back. Um, the length of these is really good too. I can't even remember what length I got. Did I get a petite or regular? I think I got regular. I'll write it all in the description anyway. But um, yeah, one thing I find as a lady my height is that sometimes the goof area of trousers is way too long. And by goof, I mean like bottom of hips <laughs> to where it goes up to. So this material down here, I find it so long sometimes it's dragging down there. And I'm like, there's not that much space for me. Like if I lower these, I guess that would kind of 
be a good example, but I personally won't be wearing them like this because they drag a lot. I guess I've got that baggy option. If I was going to wear them like this, I would definitely fold them over. Not the best fold over because the pockets would be obstructed, but I guess that is an option if you want to wear them low waist. But yeah, the pockets are popping out, so wouldn't really recommend that. Um, but yeah, there's the fold over. Um, yeah, they're cute. I like them. I personally like them. I don't... <laughs> I love the Gen Z generation and I love the generation I grew up watching like Destiny's Child would literally TLC with the low waist and their abs oh love it but for me me and my house we'll serve the Lord we will we will, we will, we will keep that lower belly <laughs> I don't know I don't know maybe one day I'll I'll be comfortable wearing stuff like that but I've gotten so comfortable in high waist and just being able to let it all hang out and not feel conscious about that anyway these are cute i love them oh no you guys you know when you buy a load of stuff thinking oh i won't like some of it and i'll send it back but then the more you try on you're like i'm keeping all of it i've only put one thing the green shorts or blue shorts rather in the send back pile one thing maybe i should also send back the jacket because let's be honest i don't know how much i'll actually wear that but they're all so cute, they're all so cute, which is good, it's good. Thank you, Bowen T, I love them. Why am I saying thank you? Please sponsor me, Bowen T. Pay me, what do you owe me? You don't really owe me, but I would love to advertise your stuff because I love your stuff, so that would be fun. Anyway, next outfit. The good news is I might have finally found something to send back. Um, I don't know, I'm not, this, this top feels a bit too long. It feels a bit too long. I don't know, what do you think guys? I'm not, I'm not loving it like I was the set in black, which leads me to wonder if I was really loving the set in black because if when you shine a light on it, it's not doing anything for you. Was it ever doing anything for you? I don't know. The flares, they're okay. They're cute. They're cute. They are cute. They are cute flares. They don't flare, I do wish, to be honest, I wish the flare of the leg started a bit higher and went a little bit wider. I do. I would prefer that personally. This is giving minimal. And I think if you're going to do it, just do it. Love the pocket. Again, super soft material. I do also love the cut of them. I think it's really pretty. Love the band and the support. But maybe it's just both of them together. Maybe I just wouldn't wear top and trousers together. It's not doing what I want it to do. But you guys, the pink with the green pink with the green now this is the this is my hey everybody look at me I'm wearing color this is a bit of that for me I love that I think that's super cute okay I would wear it like this I just would never zip it up all day no matter how cold it got I'd be like sorry this is the look this is the look we're not a walking hedge we are a human who likes fashion so yeah love this okay okay I'm sorry but oh my god Oh my gosh, I really like this. Is it cute or is it, am I, I am quite thirsty. Am I missing something? I might be dehydrated and liking this too much, but I think, sorry guys, I've got mirrors like all around. It's actually really great. I recently redecorated my room. I will have to show you. I basically just moved the bed to the side and moved everything and it's made so much more space in here. It's so much better. Don't know why I was living like I was in a married couple. I'm not, I don't need space on both sides of the bed. It's just me, so. But yeah, this is so cute so so cute I love it I love it with this I'm defo keeping this okay I'm like out of breath from just getting excited about clothes I don't know the jacket I always find with these jackets that sometimes like like my arms aren't that big they're toned but I'm not like stacked whereas these jackets make me feel stacked because it doesn't feel like there's enough space in the shoulder area again I guess I did buy small maybe I should go to medium but this is the thing with small it's so inconsistent small what Small who, and that's why I always size down. Because I'm like, actually that's terrible logic. You should probably always size up because you can always get it taken in. But for me, I'd rather have something go than something just be, mm, mm. what do you mean, mm, hold me, hold me, hold me, love me. I love this outfit, you guys. I love this outfit. Boom, 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 pop, pop, bam, bam, bam. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, man. Boom, boom, pop, pop. I feel like I would want to wear this with heels. <laughs> no. 
No? No, no. Let me move on to the next one before I get too excited. And um, so this last outfit try is the same as the blue, but in green. Now it is still similar. So I've not been folding things. I've just got like a pile <laughs> of stuff where I throw things. But it is very similar in case you've looked on the website and like, are they the same green? Even though they're named different greens, I feel like you can interchange them. Like that's, it's barely different. It's pretty much the same. I'd say this is like a little bit darker, but otherwise, they match really well, even though they're from two different sets, it's giving the same green. But this is the shorts and the crop top. I love running shorts. I think they're really flattering for me, especially like for my legs and waist. I think that they're just super duper flattering. I don't know if it's from growing up doing athletics and having to wear like crop top and knickers to sprint, but I am comfortable wearing less <laughs> when I'm working out. Otherwise it feels a bit much, it feels a bit sticky. It's like the longer trousers and the jackets I'll wear to the gym, but when I'm proper going for it, well, I say gym, I don't even go to the gym that much. I've been doing most of my workouts at home. Um, but when I am working out and I'm proper going for it, that stuff comes off. So this is more like commuter Q outfits than actual workout outfits and this is what I would actually be doing the workout in and I've just realized you guys that there's a drawstring in the shorts it's this kind of drawstring so it's not the one with the two loose ends that you can pull out all the way I know because I've done that so many times but there's a drawstring so I can actually just tighten the waist and I don't think I need to send back the shorts I had put the blue shorts, the blue shorts were the only thing in my send back pile. Okay, they're still a little bit loose when they're up all the way, but they're just not as loose. But either way, I've realized I can tighten them, meaning that I will probably keep every single thing. <laughs> I spent so much money. Please um, become a member of this channel. <laughs> $4.99 a month for access to all of my workouts, long haul, old ones, new ones, all of them. <laughs> not, not that that is, you know, feeding my shopping addiction or anything, but you know. No, just, just think about it, just think about it. This is very cute. I like it, I don't know. I like it, I like it. I feel like I could give a, come on guys, keep going. Yeah, let's go. If I like the interchange with the jacket, because the jacket really does need to be more than a one outfit jacket. Oh, I do, I do. It instantly brought summer. It brought the sun out instantly. Oh, I do like it, oh. Guys, what am I gonna do? I love it. I love it. This is cute. I think I'm gonna keep them all. I think I'm gonna keep them all. I'm sorry. I'm not sorry. I'm sorry. I'm not sorry. Okay, I'm gonna end the video there. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. Let me know which outfit's your favorite. If there are any that you didn't love, please also tell me because help me save my coin. <laughs> But let me know what outfit was your favorite, um, what other things you wanna see next, if there are any other brands you wanna see me try on, then let me know. But yeah, thanks so much for watching, you guys. I love you so much. I'm so, so excited to be back doing YouTube, sharing life with you guys. Very excited to work out in these clothes. Ah, oh, I wanna film a workout now. I think I am due to film a workout now, actually. Oh, no, wait. I need to have lunch first. I'm actually quite hungry. Anyway, I'm talking to myself. I love you so much. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.